Captain Deshant here. We secured the underground route to the coordinates. Should have seen it coming. It didn't take long after the fall of the Umbrella Corporation for their bioweapons to end up in the hands of terrorists. A new era of bioterrorism descended upon vulnerable countries, shifting the balance of power throughout the region. People in the destabilized areas soon feared another incident like Raccoon City was inevitable. As panic spread, governments of the world turned to the Global Pharmaceutical Consortium which formed the anti-terrorism unit, BSAA. Operatives of the BSAA were sent to infiltrate and neutralize bioterrorist hotspots, restoring safety and stability to various regions around the globe. Welcome to Africa. My name is Sheva Alama. Chris Redfield. Your reputation precedes you, Mr. Redfield. It's an honor. Just Chris, thanks. So you'll be accompanying me to the destination? Yes. Tensions are running high ever since the change in government. I'll bet. Intel says it's a haven for terrorists now. And I'm not going to be happy to see an American, BSAA or not. That's why I'm your partner. Help put them at ease. Well, I'm sure you'll do just fine. You okay? Yeah, sorry. It's nothing. Let's go. Casualties continue to mount over the long years I've struggled. More and more, I find myself wondering if it's all worth fighting for. Maybe one day, I'll find out. Hey, hey! Who you in Genji? I'll find a nini hafa. You don't have to get touchy. Let's go. There is one thing I do know. I have a job to do, and I'm gonna see it through. Chris here. Coming in loud and clear, Kirk. Yes, we read you. There's a black market weapons deal going down in Kijuju. That's where Irving will be. Why are you injured? Alpha team has already infiltrated the area. Oh, shit. <laughs> that, uh, that'd be because the second before the end cutscene for Chapter 1 triggered, I got smashed in the face. For the first time, and only time, and it took me to zero health. <laughs> nice. Yep. So I'm well, fucked. Well, <laughs> welcome to Character Select. My name is Dave, and with me today is... Sam. And we're playing Resident Evil 5, because apparently we're playing the entire series in reverse. Nobody knows why. Um, I am playing as Shava, and Savin's playing as Chris. Oh. Savin was apparently running through the, uh, the, the first part of the game just to get his settings correct, and... Uh, Almost died, injured, apparently. Injured himself. <laughs> so, so you know that's always good. It's all right. We're only playing on the hardest difficulty settings, so I'm are, sure me having no health is going to be fine. We are playing on professional. Well, not right? well. Okay, I, not professional. We haven't unlocked that because we're scrubs and haven't played yeah. the PC version yet. This is veteran, though. Okay, this is the second hardest difficulty level. I think in six they actually. Hey guys, what's up? That's not a person in there at all, is it, guys? Look, man. Cats did nothing to you. Fucking jerks. What the... Let me through, bitches. Fucking get stitches. Um, Hello. 
<laughs> Hello, sir. Would you like to buy my wares? Hey, can I have a beer? Oh, man. Um, I wish the merchant was in this game. Best <laughs> character. What are you buying? So Chris is wearing entirely practical sneakers. Shave is wearing nothing actually practical. Well, yeah, because she's a woman. Why would she do that? Oh, shit. Getting into some fucking sexism right there. Saban is a horrible person, people. Well, we no, I mean, this. like, in the context of being a video game, like, why would they give oh, shit yeah. about practical things? Actually, yeah, no. Okay, you're no longer a horrible person. It's entirely legit. No, I am a horrible <laughs> person, but, like, what the fuck, but, Capcom? But not in this Like, instance. let us all remember Jill Valentine, who had giant straps around her gigantic tits in the first game. And shoulder pads. Yeah, for no reason whatsoever. Like, who wears that? <laughs> and then decided to escape a freaking zombie-infested city in a tube top and a miniskirt. Mm-hmm. So that's good. Can you... God damn it, you need to heal yourself like, whoa. You know, I had a red and green herb in my inventory, but someone was like, <laughs> put away all your shit. Well, I'm sure we'll get one. Sup, buddy? Yeah, we will. <laughs> Uh, well, if you insist. Give me like 30 seconds, though. I gotta get in the mood. Whoa there, quick shot. <laughs> Maybe because of the new government, the people around here are a little on edge. You should do what you came here to do and go home. Yeah, they really roll out the red carpet for us Americans. Hey, she's British. Hey, your country or is oil. Guess what? Freedom, motherfucker. <laughs> What if I don't want to? This is a pointless interaction. I have no health. Oh, God. This is an utterly pointless interaction. Also, you need to put on your straps, motherfucker. Get strapped, motherfucker. Look at that. Diesel fucking Chris. Squares up ahead. Go through there. Alpha team's waiting at the deal location. Good. What do you know about Uroboros? Mostly just rumors. Something about visions of a doomsday project. Doomsday sounds about right. And apparently it is no rumor. You're kidding, right? You yes. Find a man named Irving. He's our only lead. Man, that's, that's who we came here to great. find. And be careful out there. Yeah, it's you too, at least buddy. it's yeah. It's at least not terrible lip syncing. But you're you're correct, it's not great. Why do we only have ten fucking bullets? Hey man, at least Chris starts this game out with a fucking gun. Let's all remember Resident Evil 1. <laughs> he dropped it, god damn it. Quote unquote dropped it. He left it in the fucking helicopter. You know it. He's just like derp for derp for derp. Also, make sure your control scheme is the way you want it, because you don't want to have to switch in the middle of a fight. How's like, the... I might have. Yeah, okay. I mean, I'm fine. Left trigger points, right trigger shoots. Right up until you realize you have tank controls and can't move while you aim. Whoa. Oh, that's right. Did they... Okay, I literally just finished playing Resident Evil 6 like two weeks ago. Mm -hmm. I honestly don't remember if it allowed you to move while you aimed. Are you six yet? I, I don't remember. It did. Like I, I played that game for two fucking years. <laughs> I have no memory. Boot it. Boot it. Boot it everywhere, everywhere. Wait. Hey, look! Another tutorial yeah, document. Down. All outsiders will receive the blade of punishment. We will bless them with the sacred death. We will release them from their bonds of wickedness. Cool story, bro. Did one. that not even heal you all the way? It's one green herb, of course not. Oh, right. Everything is a spray in this game. I was thinking of pills. You know, knowing that this was right here, I probably... Ow! Motherfucker! <laughs> Ow! Attack reaction apparently does not mean to stun. <laughs> well, Somebody's in trouble. Good. Let's go. Doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop. Stack up, because I can't open doors by myself. Going through the door together. It's called teamwork. Oh, look, we're stacking up again. What the? 
You gotta give RE5 credit, it really does have good cinematic direction. Yeah, I'll, I don't feel like the Resident Evil has ever failed to have good cinematic direction mm -hmm. in general. Except maybe the original first game, but that's besides the point. Well, yeah. And even RE2 also, was pretty decent, but... Yeah. Um, RE2 had some of the most cinematic scenes in the game. Yeah. Just in or terrible series. CGI that does not age well at all. Although apparently you're the one that told me they're remaking it, right? Yeah, they did announce that they're working on it now, so that's cool. Nice. I'm excited. That was the first Resident Evil game I ever played. See, that's healthy. Chris should have shot this guy in the face repeatedly already. Like, he knows better. He was in Code <laughs> Veronica, he was in RE1, he was in Dark Side Chronicles, or no, yeah, the but Umbrella Chronicles. In those games, he was dealing with zombies, and this guy isn't a zombie. Yeah. He's a genie. But... Oh my god, how about... Jesus! <laughs> okay. What the hell just happened? We killed a dude. See? Thanks, Leon. I mean, Chris. I mean, shut up. <laughs> Alright, oh. so you'll know that there's no exit from this room. And there's what? clearly, you know, nothing else of interest in here, so how do we progress the game? <laughs> Fucking why? I forgot about what that. What prompts about window, Chris actually. to just leap out a window? <laughs> oh my god, I forgot about the random window jumping. Like, this, this is your first hint that Chris might be incredibly unstable. <laughs> like, these guys, there's no actual B.O.W.s. This is just Chris going on a genocidal white man rampage. <laughs> Oh my god, am I another left-handed character? Yes, of course you are. God damn it. Every player, too, has to be left-handed in these games. Why? Be also, not true. We don't have any contingency plans for this situation, do we? <sighs> Hold on a sec. Shit, just... we don't share items, do we? Nope. But hey. Oh, shit. Alright, now to just not ever get hit again. Because I'll I reiterate, one room. hit did that to me last time. Oh, we're so fucked. That's fine. This is the easiest Resident Evil game. What? RE5? Yeah, by Res a long shot. Resident Evil 4 is the easiest Resident Evil game. Uh, Alright, maybe if you're good at quick time events, it is. No, oh, I took my machine gun ammo. You don't have a machine gun. Well, technically neither do you, but yes, you technically you suck up. my dick. <laughs> I invested five I really, whole minutes of my life into getting this thing. <laughs> I really dislike the fact that we start off with no bullets. How do I reload again? Uh, aim and then A. Got it. Also, I'd like to point out that the uh, M92FS mm -hmm. has a uh, standard bullet capacity of 15, not 10 game. Uh, maybe you. if you live in a free state. Chris apparently comes from California. You have 10 round <laughs> magazines. These are the civilian versions. Actually, that would make sense forces. considering this is a civilian organization. Technically. Technically. As I technically have a fully automatic machine pistol. <laughs> and our helicopter support has a rocket launcher. Mm hmm. Grab the bullets. Um, yeah. Let's take this. Oh, right. I can see. Oh. I can see what you have in your inventory. And we have limited inventory space. Yay. Incredibly Seriously, limited inventory space, too. Seriously, man. Look at those fucking biceps. Cords of fucking sinew and steel. Look, after certain events happened in the past, Chris kind of had a steroid addiction. It was fine. His penis is actually, two inches long now, but he can punch actually boulders in, in half. Uh, in um, Marvel vs. Capcom 3, where he's a playable character, there's a whole, there's like one of his win quotes is, uh, have you seen the monsters that I normally fight? I would be stupid not to build up my muscles. <laughs> also, that guy's dead. Yeah, rip, nameless turban guy. You didn't yep. matter because you were a minority, kind of. Well, he gave us a gun. 
So we're sad to see him go because he might have given us more gun. Yeah, that was actually and... the merchant from Resident Evil 4. And now we have to defend ourselves with like 20 bullets against a huge, hundreds of huge people. mob of angry minorities. Insert police violence joke here, relevant, dark humor. You know the drill. Barricade, motherfucker. Uh, I am. Don't jump out the window. Really? I shouldn't jump out the fucking... No, I was talking to myself. Do I move stuff slower than you? Well, yeah, you're a tiny little woman. I got another hand grenade. There's some bullets over behind me. For you. Some money. Because there, there seems to be a bit of an ammunition inequality at the moment. A little bit. Alright, uh, conserve your bullets, go for headshots. We do not get very many here. Even by Resident Evil standards. This game is, like, prepare to use your knife a lot. I can throw a grenade. Yes, you can throw a grenade. Well, hold on. Okay. I don't have a throw indicator. Oh. Delightful. Well, Shit. good job, Dave. Good fucking job. Oh, God, the controls are so much different. Uh, fucking punch! Fucking punch! Roundhouse kick! Oh, yeah. You, you get kicks. Like a cool person. I just punch things. <laughs> Shit. Oh, God. Man, this is so bad. Iframes, motherfucker! <laughs> God damn it, I didn't mean to kick that guy into that place. Uh, can we get out of here yet? Uh, nope. I would recommend getting behind this thing. Ah! Ah! Ow! Fuck! Boom! Seriously, abuse the shit out of iframes if you... Ah! Fuck! Now we need to get out of here. Get punched. Thank you. No, but seriously, we can't act. Ow! Oh, God. All right, now we can get oh, out of here. Oh, shit. Fucking hammer guy. I frames. I frames. Run, bitch, run. Also, get right, this machine gun. It's over here. Um... Fucking hell, I forgot how bad the intro to this is. I think you mean awesome. <laughs> it's fucking insanity, so. I have 50 machine gun bullets. Cool. Um, it is possible to kill this guy. I don't think we're gonna do it. <laughs> I also have no idea where you are. I am, uh, places with things. You're not here. Those guys just want to say hi. Shit. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Man, I'm so glad we played on Veteran. This is great. <laughs> Get punched! Ooh, check You too. Oh, God. Shit, we're... Okay, you good? Yeah, it's fine. I can do quick time events. I'm just getting all the bullets right now. Oh, God. Because I'm pretty sure we don't have the option of getting bullets later, right? All the stuff in here gets fucked up. Probably. Maybe. Actually, that's a good point. We should probably go, like, uh, where are you, collect where items. Where are you, where are you? I'll go over this way. Yeah. Okay. Shit. I was trying to keep an eye on where you... I was trying to figure out where the fuck you oh, were. Oh, Jesus. Christ, the iframes. Well, there is, technically. Uh, well, technically, there isn't until a time event happens, so... Um... It's possible to thin their numbers significantly, though. True. Ah, fuck! <laughs> oh, hello. Yet. Uh, I see we've been in bye. here before. Uh, bye. Yes. That's a dead end. Bye. <laughs> hello. Ooh. Sweet Jesus. All right, we need to find somewhere to hole up. This is. Oh God. I no. don't know where you are. It's fine. Everything's fine. This is perfect. Everything is on fire and I'm having a good time. 
Uh, do you see where I am? The, uh, bu- the top of the building that we started in? Yeah. It's, uh, it's actually pretty defensible. If you can get over here, I can try and cover you. Okay. Good cover. Actually, yeah. How did you get up there? Where, where's the L? Um, there's a there's a ladder to the right side of the door when you're facing it. Um, you got to cross the platform. It's it's not immediately there. It's on the outside of the fence. Shit. Whoa. I lost track of you again. Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll just uh, leave you to that. Uh, I'm gonna just do over here. Okie dokie. I'm just gonna chill out here, I guess. Chris, Shadow, how you up? Fuck you, Kurt! Oh, okay, I see. Uh, ah, fuck! Shit! Nah! Goddamn camera angles! Oh, god damn! Shava has somersault kicks. Delightful. Oh, no, for fuck's sake. No, I, I jumped off by accident. Okay, let's try that again just with less abject failure. It's always helpful. Ooh, ammo. Why are you constantly under attack? Uh, gee, I don't know. Maybe because I'm whitey. <laughs> and everybody hates me. Oh, and we're done. No, green herb! Ooh. It'll still be there, I think. No, it's Maybe. in the chapter. Oh, no. We're suddenly on the ground. Is this where they... It is where they do this thing! Yeah, this incredibly stupid thing. Why does that Everybody in that helicopter mask? is dead. <laughs> Everybody. Backblast, people. Yeah, everybody in that helicopter should be incredibly dead. <laughs> oh, we completed chapter 1-1. One, one. Delightful. I had 45%... Oh, because I was trying to snipe with a machine gun. That wasn't working out for me too well. Oh, well. Whoo! Alright, so... Next time on Character Select, Chapter 1-2. So, thank you very much for watching. Make sure to click that like button down below if you liked it and save it. What do you have to say about yourself? Support your local police officers. What? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I, okay. <laughs>